haven't been since I was 17, so five years ago. Affording it, and also that's when I had quite a bad experience, so that's why I've, I've never really had the uh, motivation to actually go again since I've just <laughs> made sure I've taken good care of my teeth and hope for the best. I didn't really like my dentist anyway, I didn't quite trust him, his breath used to smell. Um, and he just never really seemed that professional. And uh, basically he gave me, I was the last patient of the day, he gave me a filling, but he didn't actually wait long enough for the injections to properly take place. And it was incredibly painful. And so, <laughs> my face was completely numb afterwards. But, um, so yeah, since I never really went to the dentist, I sort of that another, a new dentist, um, after I came to university. Someone who you've, you ha actually have trust in. Someone who gains your trust as a, you know, as a uh, professional, I think, is something that is quite important. Because, it, I mean, if I had trust in my dentist, I'd, I'd still be going in now, to be honest. Someone who's very pleasant as well, I think, is quite important.